This is the Stello cot. Let's see how to assemble it. You'll need two people. Components, two end panels, two side walls, base, beam, leg pads, and a set of screws, nuts, and other fasteners. For assembly, you'll need a Phillips head and flat head screwdriver. To begin assembly, place the base flat on the ground with the openings facing up. Now you need brackets and four of the shorter screws. Place the bracket on the corner of the base so that the openings are directed outwards. Now screw it in. Do the same thing for every corner. In the middle of the wall, there are three openings. Place the pegs in the external ones and screw the eccentric pin into the middle one. Do the same on the other wall. Now, place the eccentric pins into the openings on two sides of the beam connecting the walls. The arrows show the correct direction of assembly. Slide the beam onto the pegs in the side wall. Twist the connector at least 90 degrees. Do the same on the other side. Take the newly constructed piece and gently turn it to affix the end panel. Insert these nuts into the places shown on the internal side of the side walls. The incision on the nuts shows the direction of assembly. Carefully insert the wooden pegs into these openings on both walls. Now it's time to affix the end panel. Place it gently on the pegs. Then screw it in using the screws shown. Do the same thing for every corner. Now it's time to affix the base. Slide the base in, check to see that the brackets are facing downwards with the opening facing outwards. Put the base in. And now affix it to the end panel using two screws. Take the second end panel and affix it in the same way. Insert the nuts and pegs into the side walls. After placing the end panel on, connect it to the sides and base using screws. Remember, the beam connecting the walls should always be underneath the base. The set includes pads to be placed under the legs. Stick them on. Make sure that the entire structure is correctly screwed together and that no connector is loose. The base of the cot can be affixed at three different levels. The height you mount it at should be chosen based on your child's age and level of development. When your child starts pulling themselves up on their own, use the lowest base level. To change the level of the base, unscrew the screws in both end panels of the cot. Place the base at the chosen height and screw the screws in. That's everything you need to know about Stello. Sweet dreams. Kindercraft. Easy with kids.